Nova with time goes downfield and that is intercepted by Exum and here goes Anton Exum. Before he was a standout football player at Deep Run, Virginia Tech and in the NFL, Anton Exum was rapping. One of his earliest memories from grade school was performing for his father who had a prophetic reaction. I remember taking my dad into the back room down the hall and performing a rap I had written. <laughs> Um, and, and him saying, well, you got the voice for it, son. Exum has been writing music as long as he's been running, jotting down notes and lines as they come to him, maybe one day making them into music. But football came first and demanded his focus. One of my personalities is to go all the way with things. So, uh, especially if I'm in love with them and I was definitely, um, in love with football. I think that I need to put my attention, a good amount of my attention to this um, sport or these sports if I would like to go as far as, as I want to go. Exum's career took him all the way to all ACC honors at Virginia Tech and a six-year NFL career with the Vikings and 49ers. He was fairly certain his playing days were behind him and music would be his future when a routine medical procedure had a not-so-routine scare. You flatline on a table and I guess they call it code blue or whatever, and code on the table. I mean, you can't really be scared of anything else after something like that happens. Antone's heart stopped, and he had to be brought back to life. With what many might call a second chance, Exum is not leaving any room for regrets. It solidified where I was going at the time and what I was doing. I knew that I was... I knew 100% that I was doing the right thing, that, I, that this is something special that's happening right now, and that I need to follow this with everything that I have. I can't get you out of my mind. He has released his first album of music called Cardinal Coffee, a collaboration many years in the making with Norwegian producers Eric Samkoff and Dex Barstad. Some songs and melodies have been swimming in his head for years, but it took a trip to his mother's closet to make them a reality. This is where I feel the most creative at the moment, I guess. I am a dog kept secret. Exum recorded the lyrics and some melodies for his album deep amongst a wardrobe as diverse as his music. I wanted to be somewhere that was like enclosed, um, and I've been getting great vocals out of this room. So also, my mom is a very spiritual woman, so I just think that something special is in this room. <laughs> he can spend anywhere from 30 minutes to 30 days to create a song. More instant gratification than waiting a week for a football game. You know, if I have a, um, a sound in my head that I want to get out, or I have a song written that I feel like um, is something special, I can come in here and record it at any time. Only the strong survive. And the music is as different as his mood or his surroundings. One critic said if Dennis Rodman and Lady Gaga had a child, <laughs> it would be Anton Exum. That is funny. <laughs> that, that is funny. But in many ways, it's also accurate. Exum is trying something not many have done successfully, but he's doing it his way. And so far, the reaction and support has been nothing but positive. I hope it's because the music is, 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 is pretty good. Um, but everybody's been supported from people in the you know, immediate area, throughout the state, throughout the country, even other countries um, are listening to the music. Uh, it's a really cool thing, I guess, you know, to have people be so supportive of me, you know, just kind of switching lanes like that. Um, because I, you know, in my, in, in my head, I, I, I'm doing it pretty seamlessly. I, I don't really identify with anything, so I'm able to just become whatever.